Thank you so much for joining us today. I'm Brittany Jeffers and good morning. I'm Andy Sirota. Today, the Greater Houston Coalition for Justice plans to announce a federal lawsuit claiming discrimination regarding the state takeover of HISD. KPRC 2's Corley Peel joining us live outside of HISD headquarters. Corley, good morning. Good morning. This takeover has a lot of mixed reaction. The state is saying that it will help with low performing schools, while other groups feel their rights have been stripped away. HISD is the largest school district in Texas and is now in the hands of the Texas Education Agency. Jackie Anderson with Houston Federation of Teachers says the takeover won't work. When a board is the democratically elected board is replaced and a board of managers that is appointed by the commissioner. We will have no authority. Our elected trustees will have no authority in the day to day running of the district. Our rights have been stripped away. Texas Education Commissioner Mike Morath says HISD seems to allow campuses to go years with chronic low performance. He says the goal for the takeover is to prevent schools from going multiple years with a D or F rating. Leadership is the most important um, ingredient in achieving success in any endeavor, um, uh, educating kids, uh, chief among them. The Texas State Teachers Association argues. HISD has seen improvement, moving 40 of their 50 failing schools from F and D's to passing. Governor Greg Abbott says there has been a long line of failure for HISD, and all of Texas should come together to reinvent the district to provide the best education for the students. A new superintendent and board managers will be appointed by June 1st, replacing the current board members. TEA is hosting a series of meetings about the board of managers process. Meetings will also take place March. March 29th and 30th at Hattie Mae White Educational Support Center and Kashmir High Schools. All meetings begin at 6.30 p.m. At this time, it's unclear what those changes will consist of. But parents can ask those questions at those meetings that you just saw. Again, a news conference is happening at 1230 regarding that federal lawsuit that was filed by the Greater Houston Coalition of Justice. Reporting live from HISD, Corley Peel, KPRC 2 News. Yes, many questions as things progress. Corley, thank you so much.